Next in Nine's Morning News, RBA Governor Philip Lowe breaks his silence after a tenth consecutive rate hike. When will the interest rate hike stop? The airport strike causing confusion at Melbourne Airport. A rude awakening for a Sydney family, an allegedly drunk driver behind the wheel of this crash. How one Aussie woman will make history in space. And why the turf at the MCG needs replacing. For those stories and more, see you for the news at 11.30. This is Nine News with Davina Smith. Good morning. The RBA governor has signalled the central bank is closer to a rate hike pause after yesterday's 10th consecutive rise. Let's bring in our federal politics reporter, Rhys D'Alessandro. Rhys, good morning. Uh, this comes as the federal government ramps up preparations for a budget of restraint in May. Ticket to the grand final in May, more than $680. Coming out, residents in Sydney's southwest are given a rude awakening by an allegedly drunk driver and the damage he left behind. We'll show you that next. The victims of the Whiskey A Go Go bombing remembered at a ceremony to mark 50 years since the mass killing. Why it's still unclear what really happened that night. China's dire warning to the US as tensions escalate. And how one Aussie woman will make history, plus her message to budding astronauts. Sydney family has woken to shock this morning, finding their car smashed into by an allegedly drunk driver. James Wilson has the story. Still ahead on Nine's morning news, a horror crash. Two planes collide mid-air, crashing down on a town below. The suburb in Sydney's inner west that's up in arms over at McDonald's, while locals are saying no. Netball legend Sherelle McMahon immortalised in bronze at the MCG. Plus in sport, Panthers coach Ivan Cleary's admission about his players on field argument after their loss to the Broncos. Our Prime Minister is about to leave Perth bound for India as he seeks to deepen business and defence ties with the country. Sport News Now Panthers coach Ivan Cleary admits the on-field argument between Jerome Luai and Jamin Salmon after their on-season opening. Stay with us, we'll have your weather details next. Today's weather now, Brisbane 32 and partly cloudy. Sydney's in for another hot one, 31 degrees. Canberra 10 degrees cooler and partly cloudy. Melbourne partly cloudy, reaching 18. Showers for Hobart and 16 degrees. Adelaide showers and 20 the top. And a similar forecast for Perth, but very hot, 35 degrees. Darwin showers and 31 degrees. Tomorrow's looking a bit wet and brizzy, a shower or two and 29 degrees. Sydney will be sunny and 27. Canberra clear skies and 23 degrees. Melbourne's top 21 and partly cloudy. Hobart showers in 19, Adelaide 22, Perth sunny in 27 and Darwin showers and storms in 30 degrees. And a quick check of Friday's forecast for you. Brisbane 28 and showers, 27 for Sydney, Canberra 26 and clear skies and the same for Adelaide, Hobart 23 along with Melbourne and Perth 27 degrees. And that is Nine's Morning News, the afternoon news at 4 o'clock, 5pm in Adelaide and Perth. I'm Davina Smith. We'll see you soon.